Hey guys, Brenny here and welcome to an extreme ant farm. In this episode we're going to be recovering from the crappy last episode and dominating all of those spawners. I don't even care. There could be 16 more. We're, we've got this. I went and exchanged my um, emerald blocks for uh, more emerald diamonds and I got those pork chops out that I had cooking during that battle. Uh, so what? Oh, magic going in there with the epic sword then losing it. That would make me cry. Alright, so we we need to gear up again, so we need another diamond pickaxe, there we go. Uh, what else have you got to offer for me? A diamond sword, yes. Oh wow, cheap ass swords. Let's, let's get multiple swords. Um, what else do we have in here that we want? How cheap is that? Eight? Yeah, I'll take eight for that. Uh, shovel? Shovel seven. I'm willing to take that hit. Uh, what else? Ooh, wooden pickaxe. Awesome. Um, armor. Yep. All right. What else have we got in here? All right. That is all that we have there. What does the ore shop sell us? Um, crap. Now we need to get our last bits of armor. What we're going to do is do level 30 enchantments on all of this armor. Um, I think. Seems like a decent idea. Doesn't seem too complex either, considering I have like the maddest experience farm ever. Uh, so yeah, what we're going to do now is go make some potions. Uh, I should have the requirements to make uh, some health potions. I do have my nether warts growing. Uh, ooh, and it looks like some are actually gr oh, they're not oh, <laughs> they're never grown all right guys so I'm going to make some healing potions and go enchant a level 30 enchantment on a pickaxe a sword and maybe my armor uh, what we'll do before I go though is we will what else do we have in here actually what do we possibly have oh bottles of enchanting is quite helpful uh, and we'll make a helmet and some boots there we go put away that there we go oh this is this needs like music in the background like pump up gearing up music um what's this poison don't think that will do anything because considering nothing else did anything uh although i may throw that in through the top because oh it's not a splash potion i can make it a splash potion um all right let's see what levels this gets us firstly so, uh, what's the best way to do this? This, I think, is... There we go. I can do it faster without annoying you guys. Oh, I don't... Oh, wait, what? Fucking lightning fingers right there, guys. You see that? Damn! Alright, we need to get eight more levels, then we can enchant. Uh, I think I actually have to walk this whole... Like, all the way to here just to enchant. I'd like to be able to enchant there, although we need to make the potions here anyway. So, yeah, I'll be back. Okay, guys, so we're pimping. I got a... Beast pickaxe, a shit bunch of swords. Uh, that last, this one's decent, but like, look at the other two. They were kind of crap. Um, the looting's alright, uh, like with the blaze rods, I'm down with that. Uh, I made some TNT with the bits of gunpowder I had. I kind of feel like that was a waste because I would have liked to use that on potions. Uh, as you can see, I've pimped out my farm. It's, oh, it's just, it just grows faster and faster. Like, I still want to continue making it bigger, but like, I'm never ever gonna use that much net never ever um <laughs> gonna use that much nether wart so yeah uh but yeah we got this let's put our sounds back on i don't listen to sounds while i'm using mob spawners because it's like <coughs> and it's just it shits me to death um where was it oh it was down here what am i doing uh i also repaired the hole uh down there where the water was leaking but yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to dig out the part uh, above the roof and then we are going to put two TNTs in there on the spawns and launch them in one at a time and blow up whatever's in there and then we're going to jump in and try to... Is sound playing, guys? Yeah, alright. Um, yeah, we're going to try to basically get in, get out as fast as possible, but... I'm feeling like it's not going to go like that because it did it last time. Not at all. Um, so, yeah, let's dig this top part away. How big is it? Oh, wow, it's quite big. Oh, all right, there we go. Uh, I'll be back once I've dug all this out because this isn't something you guys are going to want to watch. Plus, it will take a while. 
Okay guys, so I'm preparing to dominate. Um, just gonna pick two random areas to put the TNT in. Oh, this wasn't a good one. Um, what is there? Like, what the hell? I just hit like a solid. Um, what about here? There, that seems fine. Alright, so we're gonna put that there and that there and we've got this guys. This is our time to shine. I'm not even kidding. Uh, we'll eat up and there we go. And when this one blows up, boom and now we go down and break what what can we break what where's the stuff to break <laughs> oh yeah i'm so gone i am so gone i am so gone i am so gone no 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 oh my god 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 what the hell is even in here what is this room no no oh wow i do not like um oh there we go all right um that is, whew, that is just incredibly hard. All right, so now what our plan is, is our speed plan. So we're gonna go over here for uh, maybe less than a minute. We'll stand here for like 30 seconds. We'll go touch this wall and that should do it. Uh, trying to reset the spawns. And then when we run in there, we'll try to get in there before everything spawns. Uh, go straight for our pickaxe. Oh, actually I should probably bring Hmm, another pickaxe, but I don't have any, I know that. <clears throat> but yeah, we'll grab our pickaxe, break as many spawners as we can. There's a lot of spawners in there. Like, from the angle I was looking in at, like, but previously, I just underestimated this even more than <laughs> the amount of times I died in the previous video. I'm hoping you guys didn't get too annoyed by that. I haven't seen the feedback just yet because I, uh, Crystal's coming over soon, so I'm, I'm putting two videos, uh, making two videos at once, you know? Um, oh. <laughs> Why me? Now I gotta wait for it to heal up. Um, all right, let's go up this way and hope we don't like activate any of the spawners from here, which I don't think we will because they're like 40 blocks below. We, we need definitely need full health before we go in. Um, oh, here we go. We can go up and eat and then come back down. Oh, I should have made like instant health potions. I really, like, considering I was gearing up, I didn't prepare that well, did I? Um, alright, let's boom, boom, boom. And put that away, that away. Make some food. There we go. Eat up. And boom. Alright, here we go, guys. This is our time to shine. Drop down. And boom. And now we're going to get in there quickly because they're spawning as we speak. Jump down into here. Pick up a uh, pickaxe, pickaxe, pickaxe. There we go. There we go. Yes! All right. This is mine. Don't know what was in here. Oh, the egg. Yes, the egg. Oh, yes. Winner, Yo-Yo Masters. We have got this. That plan worked perfectly. Very happy with that. Um, oh, actually, I could have done that better. Let's just admit that. Um, but yeah, that is... Oh, yeah, this is all mine. I'm get digging this up. It's... Whew, here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. In my pants. Um, hoping... I don't know. Like, I'm going to use these to see if I can advance my trades with the other guys first. Because, you know, there's um one that's taking ingots. Uh, and if I can't, then I'll just trade them all in for ender pearls or whatever. It tra uh, what are they? What does it trade in for again? I've already blanked out. They traded in for eyes of, no, no, enderpearls, that's it, yes, called it. Alright, here we go, let's pick all these up, and there's the dragon's egg, um, so that's cool, that's cool. Uh, I like the uniqueness here, we need to dig this roof too, don't we guys? Would have forgot about that, you guys would have all commented, you're a dickhead mate! And I would have been like, yeah, I know, but calm down. Um, alright, oh my god, this is gonna be a lot of things. I can't believe I even found this, guys. I'm so pumped. I enjoyed this. It was hard, but I enjoyed it. Like, what's the point of, um, oh, come on, there's gonna be that's what she j said jokes in this, like, description or comments. Um, yeah, that, that was hard, but it was, um, worth, like, worth it. It was cool. I, I wasn't disappointed that the egg was there. That was a task. Um, I don't know if I actually have to collect it. I think... Oh, I was going to place the gold blocks then like I'm balling. Uh, I do not know if I have to collect the egg, but I know it is in a task. So I'll go break off that sign. We'll go see what signs we can break off actually now. 
Uh, let me just collect all this gold first, because we're balling. I think we have like two stacks of gold now. Um, so, I wonder how, hmm, how many like ender pearls or whatever that's going to get us will get us. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, that's how I hit a doubled up area, guys. You know how I dug through that one area and I hit obsidian and I was confused? I actually thought that was it being broken up into two rooms, but apparently it wasn't. So that's all right. Um, all right, let's go back down here and dig this. How many of you are wondering when like the ones on the ground are going to start disappearing? I'm starting to think that. Uh, all right, we'll dig this quickly. It takes five minutes, I know that. I also have known like... I've walked away from things and then came back and they're like still on the ground. Is that because they're out of my chunk load area so they don't despawn? Because couldn't you take that into your advantage at some point? Like um, have a mob spawner that throws the items out of your chunk so that they stack up forever. And then um, when you're ready to collect, you could go collect like mass items. Like would that work or am I just full of shit right now? <laughs> Thinking I'm so smart like... Ugh! Oh, wow, guys. We got, like, two stacks um, plus. Let's get this one up here. Can't miss them. Like they're... I can't miss them. I... Oh, I'm going to get you. There we go. Um, was there one on this side? No. All right. We're good to go. Um, that seems to be it. Now we need to get out of here, which I can't remember how I got in here. Uh, there is a hole. That's what she said. Um, all right. There we go. We're out of here. Oh, God, that was awesome, but hardcore. Let's get out of here. Oh, wow. I can't wait to, um, like, set up this uh, Enderman farm to the point of how I like it. I want to put pistons, pushing them into a one-by-one -one area, and then have them land one hit from death. And then I can use the one hits to, um... I, I'll use a looting sword on them, and then I'll be able to get mad amounts of enderpearls. And there you go. That's my way of improving. Where did I get a blaze rod from? Um... All right, let's go see what the ch trades are. Um, I think that's big enough, guys. Like, I, I really want to make my nether wart farm bigger, but I'm dealing with confined areas in, like, from the beginning. Why make things so large scale? Although, it'd be cool to just, like, make the maddest ant farm. All right, let's see what challenges we got here. Um, breaking the signs as you progress is allowed. Achievements below in particular order. Um, complete the metal room. Make a full enchanting room. Uh, make a large base can't be a nether fortress with kind of eh. make full diamond armor and tools uh, make an iron golem make a splash potion of harming two make food wood and enderman pearl farm done that um, make a nether fortress make the nether fortress safe and loot it kind of did that <laughs> um, uh, I'll take that as a win um, leave these to the end um, put the dragon eggs on its shrine at the top of the ant cube oh so I assume that would be up there uh, destroy all the spawners on the top of the ant cube I'd never read that is that um maybe that was added like from him um, and I need to get this but I, I could do that uh, I think that'd be quite easy so let's see how these convert down so Wow what? What? Um, let's go put these in a chest, like my crap in a chest over here. Um, that. There we go. Oh, I didn't get my sticks back, guys. I'm so crushed. Um, there. Oh, I really didn't get my sticks back. And let's see how many we had left. 33. Wow. Um, let's see what this guy offers. So, 9 equals one or we can go to this guy over here and one sec guy okay guys so we're back uh i think it's this guy that has the hmm oh he has his offer there uh what's this one's offer nine for one we'll get like them and then we'll run away and hopefully he has a new trade i wish i learned like the like they jizz out little circles i don't know if that means they've got new trades if what you know like i'd like to know that how that works that system um all right so he's still i don't know what their jizz means um no see we have the same offer here but if we look at this one he was actually cheaper for the um 
uh, thing C. So we'll transfer all these into these. I know I might be doing something wrong here, blah, 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 guys. It's going to happen. This is how I roll. I do things wrong. Uh, I can't see any other reason to need these. Um, so this is what we're going to do with them all. We're going to turn them into emeralds because I have no better use for them. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm going to have like five left, aren't I? Yeah, it looks like it. Eight goes into 64. And there we go. And boom, five left. All right, now we can actually use these five for the glistering melons. There we go. We have enough now for like unlimited enchanting really because 45 glistering melons would make like 150 potions or something. Um, hmm, I'm so lost now. Like that was my goal, guys. That hard extra area there. But what I'm going to do um, since I would like to collect up, uh, these, I'm going to wait for, hmm, wait, we'll see how many we have. Um, I'm going to try to save up for that sword now, basically guys. Um, so let's take all these out, put these up here and we have, oh, we don't have many, do we? Um, we can make these into, oh, we'll put this here, that there. Actually, we'll put that there and we'll put these in here. One other thing I also would like to do is um, make, oh crap, I forgot what it is. Let's just continue doing this. Uh, oh, ender chests in all my little realms so I can um, access my crap everywhere and like potion, have po basic potions in there, you know. Um, you know, mate, I was quite Aussie then, wasn't I? Oh, tragic. All right. Um, pick it up then. And there we go. 43 blocks. Uh, we'll get there soon. Let's see. Blaze rods. Oh, blaze rods. I put them in the chest, didn't I? Anyway, I'll be back, guys. Okay, guys. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, I spent a while getting the uh, two stacks of blaze rods. And I believe we have enough ender pearls to make... Uh, enough blocks to get the uh little disc and yeah it's a challenge so even if it is crap i'll um still be ticking something off so let's go check it out um we need to make all of these into actually you know what we need to do check this ender chest i i swear there's stuff in there i forgot about it though yeah there we go um yeah, we'll take it all out just because I don't like having crap in there. Uh, with the spare ender, ender eyes, if I do have any, I'm going to... Um, oh, well, I'll just get more. I'm going to get ender chests in all the areas. Uh, like one at the skeleton spawner, one at the blaze spawner, and then one down here. Oh, wow. Look at it. It's all grown, guys. I'm so happy with that. All right. Um, hmm. I'll show you guys how much I got. I did calculations, but let's face it, I'm not that smart, um, so I probably didn't do them correctly. Uh, we'll, we'll put away all this crap, I just didn't want it in my nice chest. Um, then we'll get all of this out. <clears throat> and I think I actually got way, oh uh, no, maybe not. Yeah, I didn't get way too much, uh, what's it called, so we're good with that, there we go. Let's continue making the, ah, oh, this is going to give me so much, what's it called? What's them called, thingy -ma bobbers? Um, it's going to give me a lot of emerald blocks. Alright, so I already have some, so that's good. Um, I totally forgot about that too in my calculations. Oh, I mined the obsidian on top of the spawner. I want to pretty that up, maybe next episode we'll pretty up the blaze spawner. Uh, same with the skeleton spawner. That's stuff I do last, just because like doesn't really change anything too much all right there we go there we go and one two three we'll just leave them out just uh for my own gain uh i don't have a crafting bench on me there we go um and we'll put this crafting bench over here oh actually where can i put it here there we go it doesn't even matter um, and here we go. Here's a stack of 64, Brenny. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Um, ooh, I'm not going to have enough, am I? Ooh. And it begins. Oh, I have enough, guys. Yes, winner. All right, um, let's 
get this sword. There we go. Come at me. There. Oh, I knew it was enchanted. Yes. Yes. Oh, look at it. It's domination. In looting level 41. If I kill um, a blaze with this, I'm going to uh, see you later. I, I think I was meant to do that last, but I, yeah, see. For the mega completionist. I think that's what you meant to do last, but I don't really care what order I do them in. Let's go kill a blaze now and see how much um we get from it because it's going to be a lot easier if I just... One, wait, wait, wait. What's it do? It's got sharpness 41, fire aspect 41, and looting 41. So basically I can one hit everything with this. Watch me lose it. <laughs> I'll fall in the lava and start crying. Like, I would probably cry, because I spent a few hours getting this. Alright, here we go. Come at me. Oh, yo-yo master! <laughs> that is awesome! Oh my god. Um, <laughs> Come here, dickhead. I want to kill you. Oh, yes. Oh, this has just gotten so easy. Um, We won't kill the enderman anymore. Actually, I'll just one hit the enderman. Let's go one hit an enderman, guys. Oh, we're balling, guys. We are oh, totally worth it. The effort to worth it ratio was totally worth it. Oh, gee willikers. Um, let's go kill some endermen. And, oh, it feels so good. It's like, it's like sex. <laughs> um, what, what else do we have? Like, I'm, I'm doing pretty good. Um, the egg on the shrine of the top of the ant. I don't know actually how to get out of there. I think I need to look at the top of the things a bit. Um, destroy all the spawners on the top. Yeah, I can do that with this beast. Look at it. I'm hitting with a disc. That's just all I'm thinking. Uh, make a large base. Can't be the nether fortress. Well, I blew that up anyway. I'll do that one now um, because I'll be able to get heaps of uh, ender eye thingies. Uh, make an iron golem. We can do that now too. Uh, we can, we can do all this uh, within a few episodes, so I'm pretty excited about that. Although, I'm, I, the series will end then, and I don't know what to do. I love the Ant Farm series, and my Survival Island series, and my Extreme Ant Farm series. Come at me. Oh, what? I only got one? Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, come to me, ho fucking homies. God. I was going to say hobos, and I was like, that's a bit rude. Why are the Endermen hobos? no reason for them to be hobos. Alright, here we go. Oh, you loved it. Oh, you loved it. <laughs> oh my god, I am so balling in ender pearls now. Oh. Let's just throw this sign over here. Because, let's face it, I'm balling. Hello, creeper. Gunpowder for me, please. Ah, oh, two, four? Really? Boom. Oh my god, I love this. I think that's where we'll end our episode, guys, on an extremely happy note. Like, I'm actually smiling. That's how cool this is. Um, so, yeah, thank you all for watching. Please hit that like button. Uh, share this video with a friend. That would be greatly appreciated. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Bye.